Do you want to make the crispiest sweet and sour pork for dinner tonight? Crispy pork, sweet and sour vegetables with pineapple chunks. Kids gonna love this dish. Are you ready? Let's get cooking. Take 750 grams of thinly sliced pork shoulder, 1 tablespoon of salt, 1 tablespoon of pepper, 2 tablespoons of corn flour. I'm not gonna create a batter here, it's a light coat, so mix them well to have an even coat. Take about 200 milliliters of neutral oil. Fry the pork in badgers if you have to, nice and separate. Try not to get the wok too crowded because they might stick together. Once they are nice and brown, drain and separate the oil. Let's use the same oil to fry the vegetables. I use thick slices of a half a large capsicum, half a large onion and two spring onions in chunks. Fry the vegetables on high heat for about 30 seconds, drain and separate the oil. Let's make the sweet and sour sauce. I use 100 milliliters of tomato ketchup, 1 can of pineapple chunks, 1 tablespoon of brown sugar, 1 tablespoon of vinegar. This is what makes all the difference of this dish. Once the sauce is thickened, add the fried vegetables and pork. You know you have done something right when the kitchen smells this good. And it only took less than 30 minutes to prepare this dish. Mix it well and it's time to plate. Sweet and sour crispy fried pork on vegetables with steaming fluffy rice. These are the types of dishes that are perfect for busy weeknights. Not too many ingredients and it only takes 30 minutes to prepare. Use a teaspoon of my chili garlic paste. It's gonna take this dish to the next level. You can use a bit of MSG at the end of stir fry. It's gonna improve the flavor. No one's gonna judge. If you would like to know how to make this chili garlic paste, check out my other video. Why would you want to do takeout when you can create such beautiful dishes with less effort? The only downside is when you start eating, you can't stop eating. So prepare in small quantities. Give it a try and tell me what you think.